Good morning, everybody. It's good to be with you this morning. We are going to continue in the in God's Word. If you want to touch the Bible, just touch it. There you go. You're touching the Bible. We're going to start with singing Good Morning, God. Good morning, God. This is your day. We are your children. Show us your way. Good morning, God. This is your day. We are your children. Show us your way. So God's going to show us his way in his true word. Today, we're going to learn about blessing. Our verse today is, I will bless him. And indeed, he will be blessed. That's our verse. So I will bless him. Well, what does blessing mean? Well, bless means God's favor, his protection, his love, his comfort. That's what blessing is. So in today's Bible story, we're going to find out about blessing. Many years went by after God gave Isaac and Rebecca twin babies named Jacob and Esau. Now they are all grown up and their father Isaac is very old and now he's blind also. One day Isaac wanted his son Esau to be the leader of the family. He said, Esau, come here. I'm an old man. I want to give you my blessing, but I want you to go out and hunt some game, cook it for me, make it tasty, and I'll give you my blessing before I die. Jacob's and Esau's mother, Rebecca, had heard what was going on. God had promised this the, the leader of the family to be Jacob. So what God plans always happens, but Rebecca should have waited for God. She should have trusted God. After Esau left, Rebecca told Jacob what she had heard. She said, you go get me some goats. We're going to make some food for your father and you're going to pretend to be Esau. Rebecca told J uh, Jacob, since Esau couldn't see, that'll be fine. And uh, uh, Jacob would get the special blessing. But mother, he said, my brother is Harry. What am I going to do if he touches me? Do as I say. So she made the food and then she covered Jacob's hands, neck and his shoulders with goat hair. Jacob would feel just like Esau. Jacob took the food and he said, uh, I'm here, father, for my blessing. Uh, Isaac wasn't sure. Come and I will touch you, my son. So he touched him whether he, he, he wanted to see whether he was Esau or not. Are you really my son Esau? I am, Jacob lied again. And he gave his father the food. Then Isaac told Jacob to come closer and kissed him. And he smelt it, and he smelt just like Esau. So Isaac gave Jacob the special blessing, thinking he was giving it to Isaac, uh, Esau. Jacob would have, uh, shouldn't have lied, because what God plans always happens. After Jacob left the tent, Esau, uh, Esau said, it came in and said, Hey, my father, here's some food for you. Now give me your blessing. <gasps> Isaac was so surprised. Who are you? I'm your son, your firstborn Esau. Then Isaac knew he had given the blessing to Jacob and not Esau. Isaac began to shake. Isaac knew that God's plan had happened, even though he tried to stop it. And he told Esau, I have blessed him, and indeed he will be blessed. Jacob's family would be blessed. Jesus came from Jacob's family, just as God had planned. Jesus died to rescue his people from sin, just as God had planned. I am happy to say that what God plans always happens. Even though Esau was sad, what God plans always happens. In our verse today, we're going to learn that that God says, I will bless him, and indeed he will be blessed. We're going to sing that. I will bless him, I will bless him, indeed he will be blessed, indeed he will be blessed. I will bless him, I will bless him, indeed he will be blessed, indeed he will be blessed. And that's from Genesis 27, 33. Today, we're, we've learned a lot about what happens in our Bible story today, but what we need to do is trust God and obey. Trusting God is better than trusting ourselves and thinking we have to scheme to get what we want. 
God always has our best interest and he does bless us in different ways. Today is, today we're going to sing Trust and Obey. For there's no other way to be happy in Jesus but to trust and obey. Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus but to trust and obey. We'll sing that one more time, okay? Nice and loud if we can. Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus, but to trust and obey. It is good to sing about trusting God and obeying God. What God plans always happens. And that's why we need to trust God. Rebecca needed to trust God. Jacob needed to trust God. Isaac needed to trust God. And so did Esau. So we learned today we need to trust God and obey. Well, I'm going to pray and we're going to ask God to just bless each and every one of you. Thank you, Father, for today. Thank you for each and every child that comes and listens to our story. We pray that you would bless them in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 See you next week. Bye.